I just filmed this entire video without the microphone on, and so now I am doing it again. How's your day going? <laughs> What's up? My name is Kayla, and if you're new to my channel, welcome. Today I'm gonna be filming a video all about a swimwear company called Breezy Swimwear. Um, this is a company that I found through Instagram. It's one of the companies that, if you recently Googled like watches, um, then they use their sponsored post to reach out to people, and it will pop up um, like as another option for you to look at. It's usually not the same site you were just looking at. It's usually a company that does the majority of their advertising through a social media platform, whether that be Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, maybe Snapchat. I don't know how many companies do that, but those are probably the three big ones because it's, you can just kind of click on the link and go like search their products. Um, so Breezy Swimmer, I noticed because it was very affordable was like the biggest thing I noticed. And then I did really like the styles of their swimsuits. I like looking into companies like this because you can get swimsuits that most people probably don't have because it's a smaller company. It's definitely like one reason I really reached out. And then again, because it was an affordable swimmer company. So I did that. They also have a coupon code that like they gave to me to help you guys get 10% off. Um, so I'm going to put that in the description box. I recommend watching the video before like deciding to buy only because there's a few things that I think you should know before buying from this company, which is, you know, there's just a few little, little things that I would have preferred to happen differently. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started because quite honestly, you'll hear the rest in the video. <laughs> okay, so first things first, the packaging. Their packaging's really cool. Um, they have, I actually got two different ones. Um, the first one that I got was this like, kind of just like plain, simple pineapple print. And the second one is this one, which actually has their name on it. I got this one second, so I'm thinking maybe as the company started to grow, they got packaging that has like their name to kind of represent their brand. Um, and let people know it's showing up on their doorstep. Um, but again, the same like pineapple print. There's a lot more on the other side, but again, it has my address on it. So I'm just not going to like flip it over. Um, and then it has their social media saying again, yeah, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter saying to follow them on there. But overall, I think both packagings are really pretty. They're clean, unique, and they stand out, which is really good because, you know, if you're going to be sending something to someone, you probably want your package to stand out from all the others. So I really did like both these and I like their like girly and cute in summary. So. so my number one complaint, um, honestly was just that the shipping took a really long time. Um, my first package got here within about two weeks, which in itself is pretty long, but I'm not super picky. I had ordered these before going down to LA and I was really hoping that like I would have been able to bring them with me, but they didn't get here in time. So it was like, whatever. Um, and then so they got here after about two weeks and then another package from the same order. So I ordered them together and they came separately. Um, that one didn't get here for about three weeks. And then the final one, which granted I ordered it maybe three days later, it was not much later. Um, that one took, was it that long? Yeah, no, it took six weeks to get here. I was just like counting the weeks in my head to like make sure I'm not being dramatic because you know, I do that a lot, but I'm not. Honestly, it took six weeks to get here. It was kind of actually really annoying because it was like, okay, is my order not even coming? Um, but that was my biggest thing. They all got here and they all came like the same product that they were on the website. Um, but that is honestly the biggest thing I would say about it was just the shipping took a long time. If you're willing to wait a little bit longer though to save a couple dollars for a swimsuit, then definitely check them out. Um, that is again, the only thing that I have really been like, okay, I did not like that at all. But again, I understand that like some things, you know, happen. They might also be getting a huge volume because if they switch from one packaging to the other, I'm guessing they're growing, which means that once again, they're like probably mailing out tons and tons of product. But I feel like six weeks is a little bit long. You know, if they'd been two, even three weeks, I was just kind of like, whatever, you know, they're just trying to push out all this product. So I can see if you look on their Instagram that they are growing. Um, but that was just a little too long for me. Honestly, it kind of was a little irritating. <laughs> the first swimsuit I've actually already opened because I got multiple packages at once and I really wasn't sure what it was. So I just went ahead and opened it. Um, and it is this red, almost like red wine. It's a very pretty, it looks really red, red on camera, but it's actually more of like a plum red color. Um, and it's almost this bandeau style top and it just has the little clippy doos on the back. And then the straps do go over your shoulders and they are adjustable, which is really nice. 
Um, and I like this one because I feel like this is a good outdoor type top. Um, it'll hold everything on in if you are outdoors and doing things. So I feel like this is almost like a sports bra cut is how I'd explain it. So if you're needing the girls to stay in, this is probably one I would check out. The bottoms for this one are very um, cheeky, which is actually what I was going for. I don't actually have many cheeky bottoms, so I was okay with having another one of those. Um, they actually feel like really nice quality. Um, to be honest, I feel like a lot of times when you buy from small companies like this, you're not really sure what kind of quality you're going to end up getting. So I was really happy to feel these actually and be like, oh wow, like they aren't not bad at all. They actually feel like they're like going to be nice and durable. And once again, like a good, like if you're outdoors running around at, like the beach or at the lake, um, I feel like this is a good swimsuit for that. Next, I'm going to open the one that came second, which is in this package. I forgot about all this so it does come with all this cool like little like notes for you there's this thank you note that says we're very happy to welcome you to the breezy swim family and appreciate your purchase again just kind of doing like the nice things that you know larger companies don't really do for us so <laughs> that's kind of fun to always see um this is my receipt let me check how much this swimsuit was all right so this one i'm about to show you doesn't have a price on the receipt Most important part is the swimsuit. It came wrapped in the tissue paper with a little sticker on it that says Breezy Swim. So that looks very pretty actually, I must say. That's nice. Again, very nice packaging. This one, I believe from what I've seen on their social media, seems like it's probably the most popular one. It's strapless and it has this nice lateral stripe going around it. And it actually has nice coverage to it though, even though it is strapless because it's a pretty wide bandeau. Um, so that's really nice for the if you're actually needing to be outdoors and not just tanning. Um, so I do really like that. Pops do have cups in them, which is also nice, um, especially with white swimsuits. I like kind of get really scared if they don't have cups in them because I don't want my nipples to show. Um, but this one does have pads and it's actually like a double layer of fabric. So I definitely think that you should be safe in this one. The bottoms are also just the same black and white um, lateral stripe pattern. Um, these are not as cheeky, but still a nice little cut in for, you know, you show off your peach a little bit. Um, another thing that kind of bothered me, and not so much me personally, but I feel like if it's somebody, I could definitely see people that this would pertain to. Um, is you ordered their swimsuits as a set. So if you ordered, for example, I think I ordered these in a medium to be safe. Um, and luckily like the first one was adjustable, but this black and white striped one is not adjustable in any way, shape or form. And that's really difficult for girls who maybe have really large and like boobs, but no butt or vice versa. Um, it's really hard to just buy one set. Um, and that's like something I know a couple of my friends have said they struggle with is they're like a small on the top and like a medium or even a large on the bottom. And that's just something that, again, I don't personally have to deal with. But I definitely know that there are people who that's something when they buy swimsuits, they really have to look at. And so just keep that in mind that you do have to buy these as one single set. Um, so if you ever get like different sizes, um, then definitely be aware of that. Right, we're going in to the final one. This is number three. Again, the same note and another receipt that probably won't have a price on it. Oh, weird. This one, do this one does have like information on it. What the heck? Okay, so this one... Um, is saying I paid $44.99 was the original price and then I got the discount um, on top of that. So yeah, so you'll save a couple bucks there. Um, making it, it's really, honestly, when you think about it, again, you're buying them as a set. I know most swimsuits at like Target or PacSun or Tilly's, um, which is where I really like to get my swimsuits. If you're gonna be paying anywhere near Honestly, 40 is going to be like the minimum because you're going to pay about $20 minimum per piece. Um, so it's typically more like 50 or 60 when you're all said and done. Another really great thing I did have um, with this company is they had phenomenal customer service. They emailed you back with kind of a, hey, we got your message and we'll get back to you as soon as we can type of dealio. And then they also sent another email like within 24 hours actually answering you where a person would take the time to read your email and actually look through it. Um, which that was always nice. I did not think this is the one I ordered. I mean, it's cute, but I don't know if this is what I ordered. I'm sure it is. I don't think they sent me the wrong thing, but like, for some reason I thought I got like a velvet swimsuit, but maybe they didn't have it in my size. Cause I know there were a few that they were kind of like out of my size. 
This one, wow, this one's really cool actually. If I did order this, go me, way to have style. It has this really cool mesh band around the top. The top is a triangle top with this kind of almost like marbly, like splatter paint pattern. Um, and it's very pretty. It has a nice um, back to it, which is very adjustable. And it has this crisscross back so to help it stay on well for you, which is always nice. Um, again, it has the pads on the inside. And these bottoms are also pretty cheeky. They're kind of like high up my leg. Um, another thing is, like I said, um, swimsuits that have like a single string like this, I feel like sometimes they feel like they're gonna break. These ones are actually, they're actually like double stitched here where they end. Um, so that is super duper nice. That double stitch there just kind of adds a little bit more durability, which is really nice, uh, especially on bottoms with a single string like this. Like I said, I kind of always have this fear they're gonna end up snapping on me and that is really embarrassing and painful and so many other bad things. Okay, so update. Um, I just tried to try on this one for like the try on portion or whatever. And this one is so small. Like if you're gonna, I bought this in a medium and I'm like a small medium typically. If you are gonna buy this one size up, um, I am debating if I want to just get it or if I want to just like return it. But this part didn't even go over my boob. It went to like the top, literally where like my chest starts to decide to peek out a little bit. It went like right there is where it ended. It was basically just like covering my neck. Um, and then these ones, like they fit and everything, they're fine. They're just like kind of tight around the waist. Like, like I feel like I would need like a large in these. Like they, I had them on and everything. That wasn't like the issue. The issue was, was like they, mm, you know, the red ones were cheeky. These are like squeezing my love handles and like my butt. So it looks like there's no strap. They're just like overlapping. Still really cute though. So overall, I did really like Breezy Swimwear um, and like the experience I had. Like I said, the customer service was great. They emailed back really quick. I think the swimsuits are unique and they're pretty high quality for especially the price you're paying. Um, again, the number one thing was just the shipping. And if you're willing to wait a little longer to save a couple dollars, then I would check it out. Um, and again, I do have my coupon code in the description box and I'll also attach a link just to their website if you guys want to check it out. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much all I really have to say. And thank you so much for watching this video, you guys. Bye.